So it's March and time to do some pest control maintenance around the house. You get out your sprayer, get your goggles and your gloves, and you go to grab the insecticide and you find a bottle that looks like this, or it looks like this, and it's separated. Uh, don't panic, it's, it's fine, you can, uh, you can reclaim that bottle, but it's a normal problem with some of today's pesticide formulations. In the old days, they used to use emulsified concentrates, which were like this. They mixed readily with water and they worked well around the, the house, but when you got them outside, they didn't hold up so well in the elements. So they came up with these new formulations like the SC, it'll say at the end of it, that's suspended concentrate. You've got pest control or pest, pesticide particles suspended in the water and uh, they settle out. If you leave it sitting on the shelf for any length of time, you may have a little separation where you can see a clear liquid on the top like this and a milky white substance below. Uh, that's pretty normal, uh, but what you want to do before you mix that is shake it up good. But there's a right and a wrong way to mix it or agitate it. You want to take the bottle, instead of just shaking it like this, you want to take it and turn it upside down and then turn it this way. You want some of those heavier solids that have settled to the bottom of the mixture to be able to float through the mixture and get back to the top. If you do this several times like this, just slowly turn it it'll get the product back into solution and you can use it properly. The same can be said for any product that is left in your sprayer for any length of time. Now, as a rule, you wanna use anything that's mixed in that sprayer the same day you mix it. But if you get interrupted and it's been sitting for a couple of hours, you can do the same technique with your sprayer. Don't just take the sprayer and shake it violently. You wanna take the sprayer, turn it upside down, and then back the other way. Do that several times and that will properly agitate the solution, get it back to where you want it to be able to use it properly. But if you have any questions about uh, solutions and how to mix them, or any other questions about spring pest control, give us a call here at Do-It-Yourself Pest Control, or check our website, and we'll be glad to help you.